Okay, we are going to do an activity. I'm going to share a word or phrase. When you hear it, what is the very first thing you think of? What is the first image that comes up in your head? A truck driver. Got a picture in your head? Was this who you pictured? Or this? Or even this? What you picture is based on your life experiences. It's not good or bad, it just is. Let's try another example. A salad. Got a picture in your head? Was this what you pictured? Or this? Or even this? Again, what you picture first is based on your life experiences. It is your bias. We all have it. Let's try another example. A country singer. Got a picture in your head? Was this who you pictured? Or this? Or even this? Remember, what you picture first is because of bias. It is implicit bias, meaning it is unconscious. We don't think about it, but it affects our view of the world. Let's try one last example. A doctor. Got a picture in your head? Was this who you pictured? Or this? Or even this? What you picture first is based on your implicit bias. That means it happens without you thinking about it. Implicit bias results in our attitudes and stereotypes and beliefs that can affect how we see or treat others. So why are we even talking about this? In the classroom, our bias affects our first impressions of classmates, teachers, assignments, seating arrangements, and more. In science, bias affects what scientists research, if they publish their work, and if they choose to go to conferences or workshops. So now I want you to think, on a scale of fist to five, how well do you understand what implicit bias means? A zero means I don't understand it at all, and a five means I completely understand it and could teach it to someone else. Thank you.